Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. Today we want to talk about the Kiva Network Testnet. We had um, an update coming from the team yesterday. Mining is ongoing. Uh, another halving is coming very soon. So the project might not take very long before it can. Uh, it could actually list on exchanges when mainnet is going to be coming because testnet has already begun. So in this particular video, I want to guide on what we need to do, how to connect our wallets, how to do P2P, everything that you need to do to do um, uh, testnet fully and be eligible for this particular airdrop. Okay, so make sure you watch the video completely till the end. And of course, if you're here for the first time, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also join our Telegram channel through the link that has been shared on the description of this video and on the first pinned comment. So first things first, I'd uh, uh, done a video about Kiva Network about a month ago. And I actually compared this project with Core, okay? For those people who did Core, Core was the most profitable airdrop of 2021. People made uh, thousands of dollars. So this is a project I'm actually associating with Core because it has a lot of similarities that it has uh, uh, their own blockchain their total supply is capped at um, 2 billion with 80% dedicated for mining. It's a project that is 100% green if you ask me. And if you're here for the first time, don't forget to get started. Um, uh, you will get the directions in the past video. And uh, of course, I'm going to be pinning the video for the for the video that will guide you to get started i'm also going to be dropping it here so that if you're here for the first time you will watch that video and uh, be able to get started so first things first we are here to talk about testnet so uh, before i guide on uh, testnet let's check something here so checking the update they released yesterday uh, about the testnet itself says as follows Okay, they are saying as follows. <clears throat> First, we sincerely um, we sincerely invite you to experience the transfer and withdraw functions of the Kiva uh, testnet. Okay, some blockchain features of the Kiva testnet are now open. Okay, you only need to complete the following steps to participate. So first of all, we are going to successfully bind your blockchain address to your... Um, account and connect to the telegram applet okay the next is uh, connect an external wallet such as metamask to the kiva test network okay and the details are actually provided here so we are going to be adding these details uh to metamask okay we are going to be adding these details on metamask so after successful binding you will receive automatically 0.1 Kiva test coin reward. Okay, we are going to receive that uh, token in our MetaMask for testing purposes. So this test coin can be used to withdraw to the bound <coughs> external wallet address or transfer to other addresses. Need to consume a Kiva as gas fee. Okay, um, the test uh, token description. The first things. Uh, Whatever we are mining is the real token. They are going to be mapped to the mainnet at a ratio of 1 to 1. That is good news. Uh, after KYC is completed, the Kiva test uh, token extraction function will be opened and Hackton will be held at the same time. The test, no uh, the test tokens can be uh, circulated in all selected ecological applications. Okay. Um, the price of the test token is based on the Kiva internal pricing system. All ecological applications will be priced accordingly and the internal transaction uh, function will be opened. Uh, when the price of Kiva test token reaches $10, it will be used as the basis for charging the majority of the mainnet, thereby effectively controlling the mainnet launch price. You can see even the price they are talking about here is just crazy. The Kiva public uh, chain token has a huge value potential due to its uh, extreme scarcity. The 0 0.1 uh, test coin issued this time is a, uh, intended to let you experience the unique charm of Kiva fast. 
Okay. So first of all, users, uh, sorry, users holding the Kiva token, to, uh, the test tokens. So that means that if you are going to do this and you get 0 0.1 test uh, token, you will be enjoying the KYC priority and have the opportunity to receive Kiva Ecological Airdrop rewards in the future, including but not limited to and NFT rewards. So you are going to be getting the NFT rewards and other extra rewards. So let's uh, go step by step. Um, the first thing we need to do, we need to add all these details on MetaMask. So how do we do that? You can see the network is uh, Kiva Testnet um, or Kiva Test. The RPC address is HTTPS uh slash i think i'll be providing these details on the description and on the first pin comment so that you can find it easy rpc.kivanet.com uh symbol is 54 okay i'm going to be adding these details on metamask live so what do we need to do remember we are adding kiva testnet on metamask so let's go that step by step so all you need to do first of all I'm going to be clicking on the network uh, section up here. So once I've clicked that, I'm going to click on add custom network. Okay. Then this is where I'm adding those details. So I write Kiva, Kiva test, or you can write Kiva test net, whichever this one doesn't matter. Kiva test net, RPC, you're going to be, um, click on add RPC, uh, the URL is um, HTTPS, okay, then there is that dot slash, then RPC dot Kiva, is it KivaNet? Yes, KivaNet dot com. If I'm not mistaken, that should be the details. RPC dot KivaNet dot com, correct. Um, okay, let me see. It might take me back, so I have to repeat, unfortunately. So let me see. Metamask sometimes can give you a hell of problems. It can, if it doesn't work, you can actually even use, um, you can use even Trust Wallet, okay? So I've just added the details once again. I've added the details, uh, Kiva Testnet. Kiva Testnet. So what you do, once you get to the um, RPC URL section, you're supposed to enter the, <clears throat> the URL, the, 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 the other option, the, um, the URL name you can actually ignore it. It's not mandatory. The RPC name you can ignore it. Just enter the URL and then proceed to add. And then it's going to appear. It's going to display like this, the, the network name, Kiva testnet, the URL, you have entered it, chain ID, you have entered it, symbol, then the block explorer, I do not think this is mandatory, but let me see, let me see if it's mandatory, uh, yes, you can see the URL here is optional, so let me, let me try to see if it's going to be adding, so once you have completed, you have uh, cross-checked every detail, they are uh, done correctly, uh, you now the save option is going to turn bold if it doesn't turn bold what you do just come and click on this option okay just come and click on that and then click on the custom okay that's what i've done when it was not able to <clears throat> allow me to save so what you do click on save the network is going to be added automatically okay so now to switch to my new network, what I need to do, I need to click on the network option right here. And then it's going to be among the list um, that I've added here. You can see the Kiva test. Okay. So Kiva test is already here. So now what I need to do for me to get the 0.1 Kiva they were talking about, I now need to go and connect MetaMask on the blockchain okay so how do we need to do that so i'm going to open my kiva app and then uh now even first before i connect eh, first before i connect uh remember i've just added kiva here so i need to click on this kiva and then i click on receive i copy the address okay you copy the address 
So once you have copied the address, now go to Kiva uh, application, then click on the uh, click on the um, on the profile at the bottom right, and then come and uh, scroll a bit. You can see where they have indicated withdraw address. Okay, you can see withdraw address here. So what you are going to do? Come and click on this pen here for editing. So once you click on that, come and enter that address here. Okay? That is the address. So we have added your address uh, successfully. So you can see the address has been added here successfully. And now what you are able to withdraw is uh, this 0 0.1. This 0 0.1 you can see... Uh, now this is withdrawable. So how do we do that? Let me click on withdraw. Okay. And I enter the amount 0 0.1 because that's what I'm able to withdraw. Okay. So come and click on confirm. All right. So once operation failed. Okay. I don't know. Let me repeat and see. Okay. Uh, they are telling me operation failed. Uh, I don't know why, but you can clearly see here now you are able to withdraw the 0 0.1. So once you have withdrawn the 0 0.1, it's going to be appearing here. It's going to be appearing um, here. I, I think I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to keep trying. If there is a problem that uh, I will need to update in our groups, I will be updating. But... Um, let me try again something here. So after a number of trials, uh, the withdrawal has not started working. Uh, it keeps saying operation failed. But what you need to do, um, just add uh, the Kiva testnet on MetaMask. Copy the wallet from MetaMask. Come and input it here. And then once you have input it here, uh, the, you are going to see 0 0.1 withdrawable. So once you get there, uh, you are actually in a good position. You have already completed what we need to do as of now. Now, very soon, P2P is going to be working because I can see the transfer option is available here. That means you will be able to buy from uh, people who have mined, who are not willing to continue. You will be able to buy if you want to. Okay. And then now, um, I think once they confirm that the withdrawals are working, you will be able to withdraw the 0 0.1 here to your MetaMask. And once you have gotten the 0 0.1, now you will be able to do testing. You will be able to swap. You will be able to send to someone from MetaMask to MetaMask uh, and so on and so forth. So I think that's all you need to do as of now. Make sure you follow this. Just get the 0 0.1. Once you, get, you, once you are eligible to get the 0 0.1, then of course you are among the first people who are going to do the KYC before we go live on mainnet. Otherwise, I'll be keeping you updated in our Telegram channel. If there is any additional information I need to provide, make sure you have joined our Telegram channel. Thank you very much. I'll be seeing you in the next video.